In the animal kingdom, males are often the dominant sex. Typically larger and more muscular, their elevated testosterone levels fuel aggression, which they use to compete for territory and mating rights. Meanwhile, females often focus on raising offspring and avoiding conflict with males. However, gender roles in nature aren't always this straightforward. In certain species, females take charge, displaying leadership in all aspects of life. They may command large groups, defend against predators, and even dictate mating dynamics. This can result in males being marginalized or dominated. While the balance may seem unfair, it reflects natural instincts shaped by evolution. Number 10. Elephants, the largest land animals, exhibit a matriarchal society. Female-led herds consist mostly of females and their young, with a matriarch guiding the group to food and water. Male calves stay until maturity, but adult males lead solitary lives, only interacting with females during mating. Once the encounter is over, both go their separate ways. Bulls respect the matriarch's authority, while females focus on nurturing their young, a cooperative system through separation. Number 9. Octopus females possess a deadly edge. While mothers take on childcare responsibilities, males pay a steep price post-mating, often becoming the mother's next meal. Cannibalism provides energy for the female to care for her eggs, increasing their survival chances. Once her role is complete, she too dies, leaving her hatchlings to fend for themselves, often engaging in cannibalism among siblings. For octopuses, survival outweighs familial bonds. Number eight. Bald eagles showcase a cooperative dynamic, sharing parenting duties equally and mating for life. However, females are larger than males, often asserting dominance over food and territory. This size advantage is evident early, as young females can overpower adult males, establishing dominance well before reaching maturity. Number 7. Spotted hyenas break traditional gender norms. Females are larger, stronger and often more aggressive, ruling packs through sheer force. Their pseudo-male genitalia adds to the confusion of their roles. During mating, females favor gentle and submissive males, reversing typical animal dynamics and ensuring harmony within their social structure. Number 6. In meerkat mobs, a dominant female reigns supreme. Larger than others, she leads with authority, often maintaining a harem of subservient males. Most offspring belong to her, reinforcing her control. Other females in the group face strict rules. Attempting to reproduce can lead to exile or infanticide. This harsh system ensures the matriarch's dominance and lineage. Number 5. Female spiders embody danger. Larger than males, their size aids in egg production and grants them dominance in mating. Males approach cautiously, knowing a misstep could be fatal. Even successful mating can end with the female killing and consuming the male, using his nutrients to nourish herself and her offspring. This sexual cannibalism underscores the peril males face in the spider world. Number four, ant colonies are a testament to female dominance. Worker ants, nearly all female, manage food gathering and colony maintenance. Male ants are fewer, often serving as disposable drones. At the colony's center is the queen, whose sole role is reproduction. She lays millions of eggs with workers dedicating their lives to caring for her and her offspring, ensuring the colony's survival. Number three, despite their similar size, female lemurs dominate through aggression. They maintain control over males by using physical force, such as biting or whipping with their tails. Competition among females for dominance is fierce, often ending in violence. The reward for these power struggles is reproductive rights, securing the continuation of their lineage. Number two, in orca pods, females lead. A matriarch governs the group often spanning generations. Females leave their pods to reproduce elsewhere while males remain close to their mothers for most of their lives. This dependence ensures better survival and mating opportunities for males while preserving the matriarch's influence over her lineage. Number one, bonobo society flips traditional gender roles with females leading through cooperation and unity. Female bonobos form strong alliances, grooming and supporting each other while males remain isolated and form fleeting bonds. These female coalitions provide protection against aggressive males, allowing them to choose mates on their terms. Through teamwork, females maintain social dominance, fostering harmony within their groups.